6 a.m. Got my coffee. Man, I already pulled one brick I'll order because it's just a single item when I was doing the label. I'm like, oh, let's grab that. So the last one that came in. So here we go. 11,206 lots. 340,000 items. Keep number that number uh, where we're going to be after today. It is, uh, we have 23 of these, actually, all parted out. 10 of these not parted out. 10 times that number. It's a lot of parts here. These are 100 parts per set, so 2300 on the table. Pulling orders. That was a single order, that's done. This one is also done. And one more brick aisle and on to Brooklyn. Oh, I forgot. Be adding these one by two tiles. And these things as well. It's a lot of parts. This uh, order has a note. Thank you for the free shipping. Look forward to this lot to complete my minifigures. We'll buy more. Yeah, we offer free shipping at $20. It's crazy, I know. PayPal fees went up quite a bit. Uh, shipping fees just went up at the beginning of October quite a bit and I did not change that I might have hired these prices a tiny bit to compensate but overall free shipping at twenty dollars that is why do I do that all right this note this note this order has a note <laughs> love the YouTube channel trying to get all the parts from my husband's birthday present Voltron, I'll be placing more orders in the future. So this is a pretty big orders for lot count here. 170. 100, 679. So we're going to count this out. We'll say it started at 7. By the time I shut off this clip, it'll probably be 7. So it's 37 is 3. So should I put an estimate on this? Um... One, two, 170 lots. Oh, I want to say 40 minutes, but I want to say 35. So 735, I should have all the parts pulled. 740, I should have it all bagged. Let's go. Trying out a new light over here. <laughs> you can move it like a fan. Makes it real bright right here. Real bright. I like it. Three of them. Once I get the camera out, I don't like the numbers. Four thirty four is two. Four thirty nine is five. One fell. Last part is back here. Two of these. Seven thirty nine. I got up to parts into seven thirty nine. U seven thirty nine. We have all this room for used. The next expansion is going right there. Two rows of those. But we'll see how that goes. I ordered some more snack ons. So here it is, 170 lots, 640 or 679 items, uh, the used parts. So I've had the question multiple times, is used worth it to part out used sets? I think it's good to have that variety because there's quite a few lots in there and it's so fast for me when someone needs a part, take the drawer, say they need um, all those little red one by ones. I just dump this out. I won't have a camera in my hand. I use two hands and start counting out one, two, three, four, and then it. I grab all those parts, and this tray is amazing. It's 
putting it right back in there. What's the tray called? I should know it by now. It's called Easy Sorter by Terco, T-E-E-R-C-O Incorporated. It's in that showing up. There it is. Um, get him a Harbor Freight Tools. It is like, I always say, it's like, uh, it's like my hammer if I was a carpenter. I could not do my job without it. I could, but it'd be very hard. So good luck on the build, and uh, thank you so much for supporting the store here. It's a beautiful looking order. So that's close, 737, it's all bagged. I was down at 731 maybe, pulling it, so it took me five, six minutes to bag it. Plus doing clips, so say four minutes. So I was just going straight at it, I don't know. So that is it, out the door. All right, here's what we're gonna add, 26 new lots. This is the last of four sets from the same little thing, so I'm sure a lot of those parts were in the other ones. So I expected this one to be a lower, kind of, ooh, look at my, my light in the background, my camera, that's interesting. It's like not leaving, I feel like it's following me. Weird, anyway, oh there it goes, <laughs> then I can't zoom. Uh, 26 new lots. Um, so I, I figured I paid five bucks for these sets. The way that the uh, the whole bundle of four sets for 20 bucks came out. So that's a very good part out here. So I got some drawers set up. I may not be able to use all these ones. When there's 23 sets, you usually have to use a full drawer. These are tiny pieces. So second part already. This is the drawer that was in my wall. These are the new parts. I'm not gonna. I fit it in there, so going in 1021. So the way that, how to do that, so on my tablet I have the drawer tell me where to find the parts I already have. So I go here, just open a new tab of this, type in 1021, submit that, and now that part is now located in 1021. What I did realize, if you're on this second screen, and you go through and change it, and then you submit from that screen, it will not keep it for some reason. I don't know if it was just something I did that day when it happened, but see, so yeah, I just opened it again, it's in 1021 now, so. And when I do these part outs, anything that's already been in my, uh, well, I put, it, I put it away, because it's over here, because I don't need to have it out. I know where to find it if for some reason I mess up, but these ones I keep out until after I'm done. Anything new, because this situation is here's the next part. You gotta find a big drawer for these. Um, if I enter something wrong or I don't, I forget to put the remark in there, then uh, I won't know where to find it because it's already put away. So I always wait, put the new parts away until the end. Here we go. Oh, got a 98. So I know a lot of you that watch this channel have watched me for a long time, you know how to do this, but for those that don't, 4316 is where that went. And then the my remarks of this part out page, I put it in right there. So once I hit upload, that will have 92 of those tires in that drawer. So now we're looking for blue. So here's a new part. Doesn't need a full drawer. I use a half of the two thirds of the drawer. 1577. 1577, and we move on. Slowly taking back my original sticker drawer. There's some in there. Some stuff. Not too much. Gotta put these in there. Alright. Light says it's 8.30. And we have all the parts uploaded, put away. I just got to build a few more of these minifigures. I did 10 here, and I'm going to do five with each figure and one dog together. So here we go again. Say so I paid $5 for them times 23, I paid 115 bucks. Actually, I got one actually for free from Cole's Cash, so 110 plus tax. We're at 115 again, perfect works out. So that is a very good part out, plus I'll have five more. Actually I'm going to be parting out four more, putting four to convention. 
and five to of each to eBay. So an extremely good part out, in my opinion. And uh, I spent 20 minutes doing this. I just had somebody. I, I did pay a little bit more, some of the parts to, to sort the parts for me. So add that in the cost, 120 some, and 2,400 more parts. Uploaded. Nice. I guess we'll look at the parts count while we're here. Cause it's so quick. 342, 531. All right. So we just added. 7,165 of these, 4,324 of these, I was supposed to get 7,500 of these and 5,000 of these. I recalibrated my scale, spent some time um, and made sure the count I had was right and they agreed that their scale probably wasn't right because mine is a better scale. So they're going to send the rest of those. There's a CTS 6000 thing, it's awesome, the recalibration, it's good to learn it after a year again. Um, it's dead on, I counted out a thousand, and I just put one on there and said one's on there, and then I had an exact count of a thousand, threw them all on there, it's one thousand. So, then I threw the rest on and got the exact counts. Just to make sure it was counting right, sometimes you do those checks, but, so what I did, I'll give you an example, uh, I'm going to edit this item I just added. So, I have this drawer 2412 here, and then NSB29 is this thing. So I'd made a, a regular drawer of these, so I don't have to run to this every time someone buys some. Um, if I see this is getting low, then I know I can just um, run and fill it right back up and kind of keep this going in this one as well. Uh, or if someone buys 100, I just might run right to this instead of trying to count out 100 out of here, right? Just, and if I have a part out that has like 50 of these, I don't have to run and oh, get to pull this out and add it to that bag. I can just put it in the drawer real quick. So I figure that's time-saving tip that I want to use. Whether it's going to work how I expect it, I don't know. Don't know, but I should double my money on both of these parts over many years or a year, I don't know, because I'm 7,500 of these. I say someone buys 100 at a time. 75 times, someone might buy a 500 or a 1,000 at some point. I don't know. Uh, but they're there for sale, and they're actually under the averages. By This one's going to be about 3 cents under the average, I think, 2 or 3, and this one's going to be about 4 five cents under the average sold price. So when you get a quantity, you have different pricing. So it works for me. Let's check the numbers now after I just uploaded them. Oh man, it's gonna be big. This is such a fast part out. 354,000 hit 350,000. It's a cheap way, I guess, but still they're quality parts at low prices. They're gonna sell it, doesn't matter. If you do your store how you wanna do it. Um, so yeah, it's sinking in now. I hit 350,000 parts. I didn't see that long ago. I hit 250,000 parts. I can pull up an Instagram and tell you how long it was. Someone's trying to be funny here. I'm buying this now. Can you switch out the legs for that part number and switch out torso to switch out the head and switch out the helmet? And finally, can you switch out the chest plate? See so attach pick. Thank you. If you have the appropriate sword and shield as well, that would be fantastic. Please save a tree and no paperwork and please send today. What? He's asking a question on that. They want that. Oh, come on. Alright, about 15 more minutes. Okay, 13. You got me. I do the podcast will be on. To comment and like the video. There we go. I just dumped out this Brooklyn quarter. It's very small. Right? $208. What did I buy? I don't know what's happening on this premiere. It says this is the premiere. Speeding up. Is there a countdown? Oh. There is a countdown. Wow. Intense. Zero. There it goes. Alright, chatting, and then we can put all this away. We have help coming at uh, noon today, so in about 90 minutes, we're gonna 
sort some Lego pieces. I'm kind of excited for that. It's weird, oddly excited. Uh, it's the biggest, I think it's the biggest sorting and upload I've ever done. Here's Embo. He's complete. He's complete. They have a Captain Rex. No helmet though. There was no helmet in here. I was looking for this clone pilot. I have this card ready. That's good. Oh, she was complete with her hair. That was pretty sweet. It's Greedo! No, okay. Anaconda Far, that's the name. I'm trying, to, I'm trying to get the complete stuff out that I can bricklink real quick. Um, yeah, she put some bomb squad troopers up. And the rest of the stuff I'm just going to get put in, uh, just put away in the wall here. Keep adding stuff. Darth Vader's. Darth Vader's. Alright, that tray of full minifigs is now empty. Just gotta put this away. Nah, I'm not. So this stuff on a brick link or, or eBay. I'm not sure yet, some of it. This is up. So I'm just gonna put all this stuff away. Got a nice pig in there. And then, uh. What is that? So I have about mm, 40 minutes before my help gets here. Um, which I don't need to be around when they help, I just gotta say do this. Uh, but I'm gonna definitely help them so we get the job done, because I don't think they could do it all by themselves. 16,000 parts in four hours for two people. It's possible, but I get unmotivated after about 7,000 parts as a single person. I'm real unmotivated. I don't want to do any more today. So, we'll all do it, the three of us. Ooh, we got a Marisk Blue. I'm gonna make a guy out of that for sure. And, uh, ooh, we got him. Let's see. Series 2 Surfer. Got the surfboard and legs. This is how much fun this is. There you go. How easy it is. I have a tan hair. And this is a complete CMF. Nice. Yep. Staging a photo. I put in some effort. Gotta do it sometimes. Sometimes. We open the sets. They're gone. We have piles of bags. Piles of bags. This is bag, what, number eight with the wand. Almost got through that. There's a small one. And we have one going over there and one going over there. And we are off. Where's Lloyd? He's gone. He's always sleeping on the job. 12.32. We probably started about 15 minutes ago. That's my guess. All right, here's an update. It's a little after two. My help's been on break for about 10 minutes. I was on break for before that for like 20 minutes, so. And we have three smaller bags left down there. I'm almost done with, there's four of them that have the same number as the big bag. And uh, there's none left here. This is the final of this section. And then there's one here, so. We are, we are getting there. Lots of parts. The last little bit here. This goes right here. These have another stuff. And that's it. Almost 3.30, 2 hours, 15 minutes, well, no, 3 hours, 15 minutes. It's like 2 hours, that was fast. It is loaded with parts. <laughs> we have another table over here. Mm -hmm. We gotta consolidate some of this. But I'll upload it tomorrow. It's gonna do some, uh, I gotta get some labels on. Some drawers. Alright, this is one of those big jobs you just gotta work a little extra. Like I said, I'm not gonna upload them tonight. It's 4.24. Um, I'm going to take those uh, labels. I had helped getting down to there, but I printed out the rest. We got one up here, and I just got to get to this bank. As long as I get this bank numbered, I may or may not need more than that, or probably I always overcompensate. I think I need a lot more than I do end up needing, but I don't really know. So I got the reddish brown in a stack here. There's lots of black. There's just really not very many variation in color. Anyway. That was fun. Three people 
and uh, sort of 16,000 some parts. <laughs> yeah, it's awesome. I love the look of them on the table. There it is. We're into it. Wednesday night project. Grab a few things out of here. We got from a uh, brick roll in Milwaukee. Sort it into a tray and put it away tomorrow. All right, just talked about this on the brick separators, and it sold for. Uh, someone paid forty-six dollars forty-seven cents plus five bucks shipping on brick all for it. So. Nice, I paid, it says this, but I paid this 20% off when I bought it, so it's like 12 bucks in 2018. Right when I, when I started this YouTube channel, it was November 2018, I got this, that Black Friday. There might be a video on it, showing it go way back, I don't know. I'm pretty sure I had, I had a video on a Black Friday haul. It must be in there, I know I had more than one, I think I got two of them, but I'm not sure it happened to the other one. But uh, yeah, it's gone. Alright, so I've been up for a little bit here. I've got 33 items to pull on eBay. It's very good. And we have five orders here on uh, Bricklink, and there's one really big order there. 146 lots, 1600 items. So that's a lot of quantity. That's what we've been waiting for orders like that because we've been uploading a lot of parts. And on Brickall, one there, and then there's the uh, set I just talked about. So. Alright, I have lots of parts to upload on my table. Alright, 6.30, I guess pulled the first Bricklink order, 57 lots, 184 items, so all the brick owls are done, uh, they're just one lot each, they're easy. And uh, so here we go, I'm heading to a big one after this next one. This is a great customer. I'm on through about 35 of these Alex sets. <laughs> Nice. Here we go. So over 10 items per lot right here. 146 lots. Lots of counting. Um, I'll give it till 7:30. I should be done. Let's hope for that. There, I prepped the table because I'm don't have much room, so I put these trays on there. Got a box ready. And first bag, the set over here. Are we done? 7:20. Not quite. <laughs> All right, here's all the new parts. On to the used. Let's show you these. So normally I have this set up to put used here and new here, but since I already got the new out, I'm just gonna put them anywhere. I'm not sure how many used there are, but we will uh, find this black piece in there. So this is why you can try. Just dump it out. And it has a sticker of this. That one. All right, the used parts are all here. Those are from the shoe boxes. So 7:33 is close. We got it done. All right, I got an order that came in extra. Yoink! Really need that flag for a set. Thanks once again. So this is somebody that I met at Bay Beach. That is actually from Upper Michigan here, in the north northern regions. So we're just gonna pull this order here. Well, it's two. In 375. Um, so he came to my booth. He gave me some tips on his. Uh, he's got a Bricklink store, and what he does, he says, there's one thing he said that really opened my eyes. Was like oh, the older sets only have like a hundred different parts, right? So as long as you learn those parts or start collecting all those parts, you can easily put together um, sets. Which, yeah, that's true, if that's what you want to do. And that's something I may do in the future. 3109 is four. Got some new watermelons. Um, so yeah, some it's cool advice and definitely something I may look into because I have some old boxes for some space sets still. And when I do my rearranging of my uh, use section over there, I'm stuck, my stuff's on back order. I think it's I think it's the stack ons that says they're stopped selling them, and my store only had two left. Um, so we'll put this away, and then we're gonna do the used parts. Only six lots here, so we got three of them. 
number six, he wants a pair of yellow legs. Beautiful. I got a little something on him, but not anymore. Beautiful yellow legs. And then, so here's the flag. And I have a note on this flag. It says, uh, my playwear and yellowing for age is normal. So it's, it was definitely still sellable, especially these old parts. Um, let me just grab the last one. 405, you got the, you got the, uh, the pufferfish hat helmet that I just put for sale a few days ago. So, my playwear is just like the little paint print loss a little in some corners. But overall, it's actually not very yellow. It's just a little, like, scratchy, this, like, dirty looking, but it's good. You know, I always test out these with a little bit of pressure to make sure there's not a crack in them. All right, so here we go. Get a part out. Get this set up on my tablet. Um, so I got to this screen, 261. I'm going to put it at the 291 and have my sale. So this is actually really close. Usually they're not this close with this high of numbers. So 291, 71, five times that by 85% because I take 15% off my sale. At this point, I'm going under. That's my part of value right there. So I like that number. And uh, so we're adding 125 new lots, which is very good for this set. I mean, there's so many common colors. It's not like the, these aren't common. Obviously I don't have these in my store. Um, but it's just a lot of black, dark bluish gray, light bluish gray, and white. And some pile of reddish brown over there. So, yeah. It's, uh, it's good. It's a good part out. It's a good set. Let's, let's get this done. Got the first part up we don't have in our store. So I have all these set up. I don't anticipate I'm going to need any more, many of these that have just like one space. I probably use a lot of the two space, but um, I mean, I might already have these in my store, so they might not be used, but there, I guess there's enough. There's some that can fit one space, like those, 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 some of those. So if I don't have them in my store, obviously, well, this doesn't look right. This doesn't look right. This one has a spot. There we go. Get that out of there, get these two out of there, and so I gotta start clearing off this table because pretty soon there'll be big drawers all lined up over here of new stuff that I have to add. I pulled one out that I found. Um, and when I was pulling that huge order, I went ahead and pulled uh, drawers as they were emptying. I normally don't do that, but because I'm gonna know I need them, they're there. Just pulled the last row of these. So I filled up all these except those five. And then from there it goes to here, which I filled up a long time ago. And then we have these ones I'll start grabbing. I'll probably have to take a couple of those and then we'll fill up the wall. All right, just finished entering everything. Everything has a place. It's in its drawer where it goes. And state of the table. <laughs> got a lot to put away and, and a few on here. Um, got a few extra out. So we ended up, well, these are, these are ones that I had to put into bigger drawers. These aren't, they are extras. I did get through the first full row up here. So this is the first one we have to do now. 39, 14 of small drawers. I was able to fill up every big drawer spot up until I left this one. I could have used it and divided it. Um, but this left it for stuff like, you know, massive amounts because you know, this, this one almost can go be consolidated down if I needed to. But I did get to, <laughs> I used up up until here so that is a new thing obviously didn't use those but it'll take a while to get to there still very excited to hit upload here oh there's one there's one issue i don't know where this drawer is it says it was in like 262 i think and uh better turn the music down before they yell at me again 262 it says I the drawer wasn't even in there. And I don't know where it went. I looked like multiple times. It's not there. My guess is it got put into a wrong spot somewhere. And when I put the drawers away, it'll, it'll, it'll work itself out. It'll, it'll be like, why is this drawer in here when this one should be in there? And I'll find it. Um, 
because it certainly is not. And when I pulled, I checked all the numbers. It was early on, so I just didn't see it. It's no big deal. I'm just going to upload it as is. I have it right here, so I can change it after the fact once I find it. Just leave that page open. Oh, almost 17,000 parts. Whoa, that's a lot. We did a lot yesterday, and I'm very excited about this upload button. I got to do it before something happens. So, six it's paid 600 bucks for these. 60 times 10 of them. So, do the math. Oh man, it's uploaded. I don't know, it might take a minute to upload all my lots. That, it looks like the lots are there. And the quantity, 369,044. Time for breakfast, 10.30. I already had a mini breakfast, but family's making breakfast. I gotta get up. All right, so I have not found the missing drawer yet. So this is all I have left to put away. Let's see if we can find it. I haven't checked, I'm just, 340 goes through it there. 423. There it is, 262 is in 423. So now I gotta go to my computer and fix that because they won't fit in there anymore. But I thought that's what I did. My wife came down and was talking to me when I was doing that part and, and I was like trying to find it for the first five minutes. I'm like, okay, I'm just gonna stop what I'm doing. We'll find that later. Because it was like taking up my time and I wasn't paying attention. So there we go. We did it. That's what I thought happened. And so now we have to probably get another one in the back here. The one I put backward. That's what I don't like about these acro mills. Is once you put them backward, it's hard to get them out. The tough store do not have that problem. So now we're gonna got one right away. Uh, forty-six ninety-three. We just have to go here, here. Did I move it? I gotta find it again. I must have got off the page. So usually I wait till the end of the day to do my wanted list. But for uh, 741, it's not focusing. 741 people were um, notified of my new parts. It's 189. Why was it so much? Oh, I did upload stuff yesterday. I never, I never synced it. Or, I did sync it. I just never hit the button from yesterday. That's why. So, awesome. I treated myself.